In America today, we are divided over many issues. The economy, social issues, foreign policy. However, there is one thing we can all agree upon. A need for using alternative energy sources to help continue the American way of life. Because our current energy usage is unsustainable, we need to find other sources of energy that can be continued long into the future to help maintain our livelihood and keep this country at the forefront. There are many alternatives to our current fuel sources that are now available. These include using ethanol-powered vehicles instead of fossil fuels, cleaner burning forms of coal, and using nuclear facilities to generate electricity. One form of alternative energy that would help achieve a more sustainable energy plan is ethanol. It is an alternative source of power that is both efficient and renewable. With this new slowly evolving technology, there is no compromise in ethanol's power output compared to gasoline-powered vehicles. With slightly less miles per gallon, it helps that ethanol costs less at the pump than gasoline. Many people worry that ethanol would increase the price of food due to the fact that it would be lowering the overall supply of corn. This is not the case. According to the American Coalition for Ethanol, energy prices have twice as much impact on food prices than corn does. This means the price of food would actually decrease due to the fact that energy prices are lower. This would also benefit farmers as it would create a new outlet for them to sell their product, thereby making their product more valuable. Overall, ethanol would benefit American society because farmers would get paid more, the price of food would go down, the price of fuel would go down, and the environment would become cleaner. Another form of alternative energy is clean coal. This is coal that has been processed differently in order to reduce the amount of greenhouse gas emissions that are produced when it is burned. The difference between clean coal technologies and technology that is being used prominently now is that clean coal technologies either reduce or capture as much as 85% of the emissions of harmful gases such as carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, and nitric oxide. These gases are not only harmful to the environment, but are also very harmful to people's health. Once breathed in, they can cause serious damage to the lungs that cannot easily be reversed. Because we rely on coal so heavily, we may as well clean it up instead of polluting further. And lastly, there is nuclear energy as a viable alternative energy to help solve the energy crisis. Often, when people hear nuclear, they immediately think atomic bombs. But atomic bombs and nuclear power plants are very different. Both use uranium, but that is about all the two have in common. Weapons need their uranium in which more than 18 times the amount that a nuclear power plant would need. This is a uranium pellet. It's about half the size of your painting. According to the Nuclear Energy Institute, one nuclear pellet contains the energy equivalent of one ton of coal, 17,000 cubic feet of natural gas, 5,000 pounds of wood, or 149 gallons of oil. Nuclear waste is managed safely through an integrated management approach in which used nuclear fuel remains stored at nuclear power plants in the near term. Eventually, the government will recycle it and place the unusable end products in a deep geologic repository. Nuclear energy is the most efficient form of technology we have developed to date. By investing in the research and development of nuclear energy in the United States, we will not only reduce our reliance on fossil fuels, but also be able to provide an ample source of power for the country while investing in development of these alternative technologies. So let's get this going. Let's get behind America's energy producers. Give them a reason to start making new alternative forms of energy that will keep this country running. Buy ethanol powered vehicles made by American companies like Chevrolet and Ford. Invest in companies like PowerSpan and Acorn Technology, which are developing cleaner forms of coal. Back nuclear research, like that done by General Electric and Westinghouse. Let those in America who create alternative energy know they have a reason to do so.